East Nashville homeowner is turning to WSMV4 investigates for help after his gas bill skyrockets four months in a row. Investigative reporter Stacy Cameron took a closer look at the bill battle and has what you can do if you find yourself shocked by a bill. We all expect our gas bill to go up in winter, a hundred, maybe two hundred dollars. But this homeowner, when he saw his gas bill jump three hundred bucks above his highest bill ever, he knew he had a problem. December, January, February, March. Looking over a collection of sky high gas bills, Andy Jones says he's frustrated. You can see that there's something wrong. The bill has tripled. And running out of options after a billing dispute with Piedmont Natural Gas. The only thing I have been told is it's not our fault. You know, you need to pay the bill. Left him with nothing but a growing balance of past due charges. The past 90 days has been almost $1,500. Jones's problems began with a $358 November bill and got worse with a $532 charge in December, figuring Piedmont made a mistake. We've been here for almost five years and the highest bill we've had is $240, $250. Jones says he called Piedmont, disputing both bills, told the charges were correct. Jones had a serviceman inspect all his gas appliances. That turned up nothing. There was no leakage. Bringing us to January and a $529 bill. Jones panicked, saying he called Piedmont, demanding someone come out and read his meter. And at first, Jones thought, problem fixed. So the technician came out, he did a walk around, looked at the meter. While a Piedmont technician replaced his gas meter, relief turned to frustration when Jones says Piedmont refused to admit that the meter was the problem. And they said, we can't find anything wrong with your service, so we don't owe you any money. That's when Jones asked for our help. Do you have a house full of people living here using those appliances? Nope, just two adults. And we reached out to Piedmont for answers. By email, the company says it sent Jones meter to Georgia for testing in late March. The results just came back this week saying the meter isn't broken. So for Jones, the high bill confusion keeps growing. I mean, I wish there was something I could figure out we're doing wrong. Tacking on $344 in March, Jones' total winter bill topped $1,700. If you're a gas customer with a problem like Jones, remember these three things. One, if you dispute charges, you have to do it within 15 days of the billing date. Two, while you're disputing charges, the gas company can't tack on late fees. And three, if your meter isn't broken, the gas company will come out and inspect your gas lines and appliances for free. And Jones says Piedmont is doing that at his home next week. We'll let you know if anything changes. For WSMV4, I'm investigative reporter Stacy Cameron.